Time for another pet on the set, and we have for today Kathleen Orcutt from the Vermilion County Animal Shelter with Piggy. Tell us about Piggy. Piggy is a little female kitten. Aww. She's about eight to nine weeks old. Aww. She is one of 14 kittens that I picked up off of a property. I was out handing out flyers for our um, adoption event that we just did through Bissell, and I saw a sign that said free kittens, and I couldn't just drive by and leave them, so I went and picked them all up um, and talked to the owner, and we picked everybody up. They hung out in my bathroom for a while till we cleared our isolation that we were going through. And now they're all slowly getting homes. And I think there's about four or five left out of the litter that are looking for homes. And you know, you were mentioning that you guys had an adoption event going on. How's that been going? It was absolutely wonderful. It was the biggest one that we've done through Bissell. It just ended Tuesday, so we don't have all the numbers yet, but um, we had a great big uh, thick folder full of surveys from all the adoptions that we were able to do through Bissell. It was absolutely wonderful. And we're getting closer and closer towards the kind of end of fall. Well, we're in the middle of fall, but getting closer to the colder seasons here. As this morning was pretty cold. I don't mm -hmm. know about Piggy. I thought it was pretty cold out there this morning. <laughs> uh, what are some of the ways that we can kind of help you guys get ready for this winter season? Um, we're definitely going to be watching in the area for animals that we know stay outside a lot. Um, so donations of bales of straw. We don't like to use blankets because they can get wet and freeze. Um, dog food, canned dog food, um, our basic usual donations along with bales of straw are always helpful. And you mentioned we just had that event coming up or that you just had. Any uh, coming up here that people can get involved with? Um, Seven Point in Danville is hosting us on the next weekend. Um, we're going to be having a trunk or treat. All those events are on our Facebook page. Um, we put all of our events on the Facebook page because it's easier for people to keep track of. Mm -hmm. Some of those events pop up and people don't have a lot of time to um, prepare for them, so we try to keep them on our Facebook page. But <laughs> She's just so curious this morning here. She is. What's the best way to get in contact with you guys if you want to see more kitty cats like Piggy? Um, on our Facebook page or if you go to PetTango.com, all of our available animals are listed on there. Those animals change quite frequently because we get a lot of strays in and we hold them for seven days and then depending on um, their status, they are listed available, but we keep them all current on the website. All right. Thank you so much, Piggy, for being a great model for one and for two, uh, just being so cute and active for today. Thank you for coming in, Kathleen. Thank you. And if you want to see this interview again, you can check out WCIA.com. We'll have that up later on for today. Thanks, guys.